on the wide side of the field. They have yet to throw the football, which was their calling card last year. Patron in trouble and on his way down. He ripped down. And the sack Second belonged. Less than a yard, as you mentioned, third and long. They stay in the gun. He can run for it if he wants to. Instead, puts it up for grabs, and it's picked off. Coming up with the interception. The D back on that side, still on his feet. And will he take it in? No, down to the five yard line for the Aggies. Stephen Campbell with the interception. Oh, so accurate through the air. Christian Michael joining Cyrus Gray in the backfield from the four. It's Gray. Huge hole, he's in. Touchdown, AM. And check that. Christian Michael, 33, not 32. So they convert on third and three. Five minutes into the ball game, already a deficit for the Mustangs. Coming off the edge, pick up the blitz. Patron scrambling, doesn't get back to the line. It'll be the second sack of the game. In rhythm, those two offenses you're talking about. Third and short. Patron out of the gun. Had an alley to run if he wanted to. Better lane to throw and throws it over his intended target. It's picked off once again. The safety coming up with it, Trent Hunter, all the way across the midfield stripe to the 45. Another mistake by Patron. Settle down right now. Two mistakes early. Cyrus Gray, the single to the backfield. Man, it'll be great. Good running. Inside the 35. Not bad. It'll be second and 10. Out on the edge, Tannehill. Got to tie it in, and he finds him inside the 20. It's Michael Lamar. Chris Banjo wearing number 23. Great story. Safety has to be productive for them this year. Wearing the number to honor Jerry Levias. Gray on his way. Is he there? Yes. Touchdown AM. So Michael is there. Bring the extra rusher and wide open out of the end. Darius Johnson. Big yardage for Johnson. It's second and ten from the 28. They heard you. Big hole for line. Will he take it in to the 10 to the 5? On his way. Yes. Touchdown. SMU. It's last season. It'll be Coriel Judy back deep along with Stephen Campbell. And the onside kick. Didn't make it. Didn't work. <laughs> unbalanced yeah, formation. Unba and unbalanced short side. And they waggle it the other way. Diving attempt. Is it taken in cleanly? Yes. Swope's got his first catch of the new season. In the eye. It'll be Bray. He's in. Touchdown AM. Three of the shows. Maybe a delay. No. It'll go in the air. Taking his time, and he's got a wide open receiver. It's complete for Johnson. First down. From the 27. Going for the bundle, wide open, touchdown, Cole Beasley, no. Keenan Holman instead. Is getting taken advantage of. Third and eight, barely get the play off. Line won't get for the first down. So it worked early on this drive. Very quiet now at Kyle Field. Look for the double move on the outside. That was taken away. Inside, he's got smoke, touchdown, and M. together once again. Pocket holds up, but he's not going to stay up. Gerard Eddy on the sack. If they confuse the secondary of AM once again with that formation you're talking about. Nope. McDermott hit from beyond. Coming in. And it was a blind side hit. Crawford on the coverage. Plenty of time. Especially with the clock stopping every time the big first down. Low throw. How about that scoop by Swope? Not too shabby. Inside the 15 yard line. Game of seven. Michael again, and they blow it open right up the middle. He lost the football on his way down. He'll see. It's Gray. He lunges. He's got it. Touchdown AM. And Marcus Allen in just a moment. Second and long after the loss of a yard. Tannehill looking one way, and he's got Jeff Fuller. He used his man underneath. And Wachiku, an underclassman, it was seen, uh, he went to the senior. And breaking into the secondary is Gray. Touchdown saving tackle into the secondary. 
Kugel try up and perfect by Randy Bullock. A short one at that. Sergio Knox didn't tackle worth a lick in the first half. Doing a better job of slowing yes. them down there. Jonathan Street 3,000 on their feet. The noise factor at Kyle Field. Hit as he releases it and almost and they're ready. Talking to Steve Orsini, the athletic director for the Mustangs of SMU. So Tannehill after the short game. A draw all the way from Cyrus Gray. He's into the secondary. Facilities in a great school, in a great city. We feel we can build it back to a top 25 program and everything we do. Down the middle, the tight ends available. Touchdown, Hudson Prelo. Final three minutes of the third. And he's on his way down. Coming up at some point, he was playing too well. Gerard Johnson never saw the field. Kristen Michael, not a bad adjustment behind the line. Pretty decent reels as a backup tailback. Really, not bad. Really good speed. <laughs> Six. And here comes the pressure again. Gerard Eddy has been a force in box. That's a great game. Good young quarterback. Right, Josh good, Freeman, good Matthew young. Stapp. Defensive line for the Lions. Adjusting. And a first down. Christian Michael before that at 8 for 54. So just about a second. Long field goal try. About a 37-yarder officially. And it's good. For Randy Bullock. Well, they know he's good from 37. McDermott. Brings it back down, and he should have gotten rid of it. There's a fumble. The battle. And did the trips on the wide side up top. Here comes the heat, and there goes McDermott. Now yeah, they celebrate in Aggieland. Kirby Ennis on the stop. The sophomore gets to the balance. Great rushing game. And from both Christian Michael and Cyrus Gray. So the balance was there, and a complete effort in the second half that included the defense pitching a shutout. Our entire college football Saturday crew. I'm Joel Myers. Thanks for joining us. So long, College Station, Texas.